Hey guys, if you're watching this, you probably have some problems with your sprinkler system. So I'm gonna go over a few troubleshooting techniques that I've used to fix my lack of pressure in my sprinkler irrigation system. So here we go. First off, you wanna find your main valve that feeds your, your property with your sprinkler system. Uh, my main valve comes into this box. It branches off to a hose. Highly recommend you putting that in. It'll help you decipher if it's your problem or a city's problem. And I have a valve in here that goes to that hose and a filter. All right, I got my box dug out. Uh, as you can see, uh, let's see, again, the valve comes down into this pipe right here, around to the filter. Off the filter, I it goes to my hose. I think it's a clean out hose. And then it goes off and out to my system. So as you can see, my filter is pretty dirty, full of sand. So. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you how to open up this valve and shoot water across the street. And we'll see how far it goes. Alright, I got good pressure. I think you can see it. It's going over to about uh, those rose bushes over there. But I should have a lot more water pressure than this. So we're going to clean out the filter. So I got the filter out. As you can see, it's all caked with some sand. So. Got the filter back in, got the hose plugged up. Now, let's see, I don't know if I can do this one-handed, so I'm gonna set the, the camera down for a minute. Uh, I don't know if you can tell a little bit. Definitely feels like it has a lot more pressure. Um, but yeah, let's go take a look at our sprinklers now. All right, here's one of my sprinklers that was giving me a little bit of problems. It's definitely doing much better. I can see more water going over there by my palm tree and my flowers. But something else that we have, as you can see down here, see the water coming out? I got some sand stuck in my sprinkler head that I need to try to get out. So one thing that you can do is that you can try to do that. I didn't get it. So I'm going to dig this one out. All right, we got it all dug out. As you can see, I got a half inch plastic hose coming off my main line. My main irrigation line is a one inch. But once you get it all dug out, man, these just un unscrew. And there you go. That's it. Not all that. All right, we got our sprinkler out. And all we're going to do is you can pull up right here, pops out. I can feel it's pretty grimy in there, um, but you pull it out, you pinch down here, and then you can just unscrew uh, your nozzle, and then inside, check that out. A bunch of dirt. So we'll get this cleaned up. I don't know if you can see in there, but there's a bunch of dirt in there. And then I'll take this apart, spray everything out. You can just drop it back down in there. It's not going anywhere. Pull this out. That pulls our spring. I don't know if you can see in there, but there's still a bunch of dirt in there. So I'm going to take all this apart. We're going to put that in, follow the grooves. Put our bring back on in our top, tighten them up. Now that's still inside there and we can't get to it. So just take your nozzle. Uh, there's another piece that comes stock with these, uh, a cap with a, a finger pull on it. But just take your nozzle, put it in there, get two or three screws on. Then you can grab it, pull it up, pinch it, and then finish it off. Nice and tight. That slides a lot better, so we're gonna go put this back on and I'll show you that we stopped the leak coming out of the bottom. Or actually, it's coming out of right here. Um, so the water pressure will blow this up and it will make that seal right there. So, And it looks like always I forgot my filter. So I'm gonna take this part, put my filter back on and then we'll go install it.
All right, got put back on. Let's start up our sprinklers and see how this works. All right, looks like I got it put back together correctly. There's another piece of uh, dirt that was in there. So all I'm gonna do is just get it buried and turn that piece to get it spraying in my grass. So thanks for watching. If you like this, found it useful, uh, like, help me out, subscribe to this, share it. Uh, do whatever, but if I miss something, uh, let me know. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think. Thanks. Have a good day.